Okay, so we have some more trade-offs to do in this video. Once again, it's going to be something for my red loadout. So I, at some point, I'm not sure if it's going to happen, but at some point I really dream about getting the MVP prints for my red loadout, but it's extremely expensive. It costs like 2200 in cash. Um, so for now, at least, I will try to get the EVP wildfire. That's probably the best red EVP I can get at this point. So we'll do some trade-offs. And how is this is going to work is I'm going to use uh, five of each of these P2000 and P90. We're going to do two of these trade-offs because 70 euros. So they are extremely, extremely, uh, yeah, expensive. And we have 25% chance for each outcome. So there is four outcomes, two for each collection. If we do hit the right collection, we can either get the FAMAS or the uh, AVP wildfire. The FAMAS is definitely the worst outcome we can get. Extremely trouble is like 20 euros or something. Um, so it's a 50 euro loss. If you get the AVP, it's like 115 euros or something. So that's like 45, maybe 50 euros profit. Then we can get from the from the Revolution collection, the P2000, P2000. We can either get the AK headshot or the M4 to Muka. And the M4 is also around 110, 115 euros, around the same as the VP. And the AK is like, is it, the AK is the only skin that will come out in minimal wear. All others will be factory new because it has a different float cap. Uh, so that's sucks a little bit but if i had to get low enough floats to get the ak infection as well it will just it will cost way more to do the trade up and wouldn't be as profitable um so the ak is on memoir but the ak is still i think 40 45 euros so it is a loss but it's it's a good amount of money back so 25 percent chance to get absolutely nothing and lose 50 euros uh, 50 percent chance to win uh, yeah make profit of 50 euros and then 25 percent chance to lose like 20 15 euros or something so that's not as terrible so let me just go ahead and make the first trade up ready and we'll get straight into it okay so the trade up is now ready the first one let's do it in three two one come on no way Oh my god, it's a 25% chance to get this and this is the absolutely worst thing we could get. It was the right collection. Uh, no way. Damn, that's rough man. At least we have another one I guess. Okay, so next trade up, second trade up is ready now. I mean, we got absolutely smacked in the first one getting the FMS. I really just hope we don't get it this time and hopefully we can get either the AVP or the info then I think we'll still make money back in total for these two trade-ups so let's do it in three two one come on okay okay that's the best outcome it's not the AVP so it's not what we wanted but this should be pretty nice so we spent 140 euros in total, I checked the price right before, it has also been on the screen, of course, uh, for the FAMAS it was 20 euros, 19 euros actually, um, which is really bad, but this one should be pretty good, let me just check it. Okay, so I just checked the price, I know you already know it, but it's around 140 euros, so I, Steam fees is 15%, which means I have a total of like 160 euros, so it will go like, it will go like, yeah, around 20 euros for Steam fees, and yeah, so 20 euros minus the 160 we got back is 140. So because we did get the info uh, in factory new here, we did make a you know, break even. Um, so. <laughs> It was a rough start, I mean, if you just got anything else than the FAMAS in the first one, it would have been pretty good. Uh, because the info is 140 euros, spend 140 euros on the trade-ups. So anything else than the info would but just have been straight profit. Um, yeah, so <laughs> a little bit rough we got the FAMAS, but at least the, the info made it up and we actually didn't end up losing uh, money. So, yeah. It could be a lot worse. 
I, I'm pretty glad they get the info in factory new.